Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to this brand new Android library tutorial. And today in this video, I will take you through the steps to integrate the Twitter HUD icon into our Android app. So as you can see, this is how it actually look inside our Android app once we have done. So as we know, we are Twitter users and most in case we have seen this. So in this video, we are going to have a look at how we can able to integrate this feature into our Android app. So now you can see inside this like button library which is hosted inside the github we have a feature that we can able to use the star icon this heart icon and also the thumbs up icon and this library offer a custom icon which we can able to customize it according to our preference so let's go and have a look at how we can able to use it so first off we have to add this maven so just copy that and go to the project level gradle file and you have to paste it all the way down inside the respiratory so i'm going to paste it here now going back and just copying this copying it and going to this app level gradle file and i'm going to paste it here so just adding the implementation space and pasting it here then clicking on the sync now now next thing is that we have to simply copy this thing so actually we can use this this code to just add three different kind of icons which is, which are these three things so if you want to add this icon then you will have to just create or if you you will have to just get the reference inside the main activity so in this video we are going to use these three things and just in case if you want to just add this fourth one then you can also go through these steps that have that has been shown here okay now let's go and uh, next thing is that we have to go to this activity underscore main and right now I'm using a empty activity with a relative layout so the next thing is that I'm going to create a linear layout so that I can able to add this icon in an adjacent manner okay so now I have created a linear layout and as you can see this is how it actually look now just in case if you want then you can simply post this video and copy all these codes now what I'm going to do is that I'm going to paste the thing that we just copied from this website which is this thing just right click copy going back to Android studio pasting it here and the next thing is that we have to copy or we can just replace the same thing and in, and in each time we have to replace this type with the one that is shown here so let's go and yeah you can see we have the hurt then thumbs up or thumbs down yeah it's thumbs up and then your yes, star so this time we have to replace this hurt with thumbs also just in case if you want to add the reference then you will have to use a unique id and finally we have to paste it again and this time the hurt into star the preview is actually not shown here but if you're trying to run this app then you'll be definitely finding the preview so if you want to go more advanced level and if you want to just make sure each of the item is clicked or if each of the icon is checked or not then you can add the reference through the id inside the main activity and by that you, you will get in every single thing like liker then unliker so there is a event listener and you can also do things like this and uh, you can also go to the app then go to this src java and main activity dot java and you will find everything that you actually you can able to do using this library so i would say that that's pretty much easy and uh, just in case if you want to do that you can see here is a method that uses the custom icon which we have seen at the fourth one that is the custom icon then you can do through just by using this main activity class file so this is the custom one okay so now we have added the thing and uh, now let's go and try this in a real android device okay guys so we have the android app in the android device and we have three different previews and uh, what i'm going to do is that i'm going to select the first one and blam you can see and there is a small animation and I'm going to select the second one and now the third one now this time I'm going to press it again to uncheck it so that's it so if you like this video then give it a big thumbs up and as always thanks for watching and I hope to see you in my next video peace out